Hi guys, welcome back for the Transformers review and this day it will be the Transformers 2 movie 1986 the movie studio series Bumblebee Alright, right out of the bat you can see the box, uh, the Transformers 86 the movie logo Alright, so uh, this is a window uh, which you can look at Bumblebee, you can even touch it, there's no plastic protection at all He'll say this is animated uh, CGI rendered Bumblebee, the, the art Nice box art and on the other side it says SS 86 Bumblebee Deluxe Class and this is how it transforms 23 steps. Okay, and here is uh Bumblebee. Alrighty, let's crack him open and you have a better look at him. Alright guys, this is the unboxing as well. This is what is in the box. Alright, this is SS86 Bumblebee. Alright, this is how it looks like. And this is his weapon. Okay. He also comes with the uh, box art. Okay, Cybertronian look. Right there. Okay, I think this is, is the stand where, uh, where most of the Studio Series uh, Transformers uh, comes with. Okay, he also comes with a manual. Alright, this manual. Okay, let's move this aside for the moment. And this is the manual for SS86 Bumblebee. Okay, left, right, and right to left. And also from the back as well. Okay. Hi guys, this is the Studio 86 Bum SS86 Bumblebee out of pack packaging. Alright, so my uh, here is the uh, him in robot mode. Just look at his face. Okay, this is the G1-ish look to him. Nice head scout, nice Autobot logo. Alright, this is how you look at him right here. And here is the sides of Bumblebee. Okay, the back. It's a bit of a bit of a uh, backpack here, but it's still nice. Okay, he comes also with a traditional uh, his weapon. All right, which you can see right here. The color is actually painted in gray. Alright guys, let's talk about his articulation right now. I'm going to zoom in. Okay, B does uh, rotate a full 60, a full 360. Not tricksy, sorry, I mispronounced. He has these horns. He does look up and down slightly. Alright, and his hands are on the ball joint. You can see it goes a full 360 as well. It goes uh, up. Goes this way and rotates this. I mean, you can this uh, can stretch out and in. Okay, he has a. Uh, you can rot swivel this on the arm, the upper arm. You can bend this on the elbow, and also he has a wrist rotation right here. However, the wrist is actually one piece. It's not. Uh, the fingers do not articulate. Right, and right now he has a waist articulation. All the way just like this, his leg does able to kick back and forth. He is also able to do the splits just like this. You can also swivel at the upper thigh. You can also bend it on the 90 uh, angle, uh, bend it on the knee like this. However, you can get more articulation by actually there's an extra joint right here which you can pull to make him uh, a bit more articulated. All right, you can ro however rock uh, the uh, lower leg, left and right, thanks to this joint over here. All right, and to let you see B holding his weapon, just like that. All right, so this is how in regards to his articulation in robot mode. Alright, so the first step of the transformation. Okay, lower the uh, pop out the chest piece right here. Okay, just like that. 
Next one you need to do, bring the neck and head downwards all the way in, just like this, in this position. Alright, after this, you can actually rotate to the side and bring this backpack all the way up and angle it just like this, straight. And after that, you can snap the chest plate right here back to its original uh, space. Next, what you need to do is come to this side fold the hand this way until you hear a slight click okay yep angle it that way what you need to do now is rotate this hands down this way and also repeat the same process for the other side just like this right after that you need to bring this forwards this piece up just like this and position it this way Repeat the same process for the other side. Bring it up. Like that. Guys, after doing this, rotate to the back and you can combine this together because you have a pack here that enters to the pack hole here. By however, you need to bend it this way. Bend it this way. Just like that. Okay, make sure it's straight and pack them together just like that okay just here click that's how you do it after doing that we need to fold this down and compress it okay just compress it downwards okay just like that however you need to make sure this piece right here is aligned to this uh, pack hole here Okay, let me show you. Just like, let me zoom in. Okay, just like this. Pack in properly on the sides. The pack hole is here at the side. Make sure you pack in nicely. Okay, I'm just gonna zoom out. Okay, and this is how uh, Bumblebee back transformation has been com is completed. Okay, after completing the transformation, let's focus on the legs. Okay, at this point, right here, you need to lower this part. Okay, come to this part, angle it, uh, basically snap it out this way, and move this angle it up and open this up and snap this in repeat the same process for the other leg as well just like that okay okay after doing that just rotate to the front combine the front section this pack to this pack hole and after that drag it down just like that to form the front of the vehicle. After doing this, come to this side, make sure you pack this toes in slightly, just like that. Okay, so uh, that's so that's done properly. After doing that, you need to come to this side, pack in this pack to this pack hole, just like that, until here it snaps, all right? and bring this hip portion or leg portion up this way okay, after this you need to bend the knee a bit just like that okay it will become loose just hold this tight and lower this part here and the front portion of the vehicle will come up just like that and then just combine it together just like this Yep, just make sure that it's packed in properly, left and right. Yes, and you have Bumblebee transformed in his vehicle mode.
And guys, now you have Bumblebee fully transformed in his vehicle. Mode is a uh, bright yellow. You see the Autobot logo on the front of the hood and also the uh, top of the hood. All right, here is the uh, side view. Be the behind view, you have the brake indicators all there and also the uh, on the other side as well. And also this is the bottom of it. Yeah, however, you can hardly see any parts, uh, basically any uh, robot cable, just except this, the hands, okay. However, this is a nicely executed uh, Bumblebee 1986 figure vehicle mode, okay. So you see the rims are painted uh, basically uh, grey, it spins very well, it's made of course plastic, and this is uh, the bumper view, all black, okay, headlights are grey. And as you have the also side mirrors, uh, you can't see through the basically the black windscreen, back and left and back again. All right, this is how uh, he looks like. All right, guys, now this is uh, I've completed the review for this. Right, however, there's a color the mismatch in regards to the uh, colors. You can see it's uh, other than that, everything is quite. Uh, down to the T, basically it's uh, quite uh, accurate to the uh, 1986 movie Bumblebee. Alright, this is Cool Boss 2008 signing off. If you do like the review, click on the subscribe button below and I'll bring, bring you more reviews in the future. Cheers. Bye.